My dad brought this recipe back from the army back in the 60s. Y'all may call it something else, but let's get started. This is gonna make a pretty good pot full. That's three pounds of ground meat. That's just regular old 80 20. I don't have anything in here but this meat right now because I gotta drain this fat off of it here in a minute. I brown mine to it's about medium, about like that, where you can still see some pink in there. And then I take it over here and strain it. I see I put that foil around that strainer down there. It sure makes it a lot easier because once it cools off, you can just water it up and throw it in the trash. Y'all see how that foil catches all that grease? All right, I got it back over here on the heat. Now I'm gonna add a, about a medium onion diced up. And then I'm gonna add about a tablespoon of salt. About a tablespoon of black pepper. About a tablespoon of garlic powder. We're just gonna cook this, these onions are cleared a little bit. All right, these onions are softened up and this meat's cooked all the way through. I don't like crunchy onions in it. So here we go, gonna go with a half cup flour. We're just gonna slowly incorporate it. All right, I got all that flour incorporated good. This is a 10 and a half, 10 and a half ounce can of cream of mushroom soup. We're gonna stir that all in real good. Cream of mushroom all stirred in. Now we're gonna start adding four cups of whole milk slowly and stir it in. You just wanna bring it to a low simmer for a few minutes and just keep stirring, stir everything in. That's about the consistency I like mine. Now you need to check it now for salt and pepper. You might need to add a little or add a little more milk if you want it not as thick. See here, this is how we always eat it on a piece of light bread. Either that or made some mashed potatoes. Put Miss Flash Zippy Zap on it. See how it is. Mm -mm. Y'all make your own. It's good. Feed a lot of people for cheap. Have a good weekend.